thanks for watching the video. So today I'm back with a full glam look. It's a cut crease with gold and cranberry. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified for my next videos and give a like if you enjoyed. So yeah, without further ado, let's jump right into the video. So to start off the makeup, I'm going to prime my lids using the Urban Decay Primer Potion. Then to make sure the eyeshadows blend, I'm going to set my lids with a translucent powder. And we're going to start building the transition color which is Creme Brulee from Makeup Geek. Oh, and if you're wondering, all the brushes and products are listed down below. Now grabbing a dark brown which here is Coco Bear from Makeup Geek and a fluffy brush, you're going to start deepening that crease. Uh, does deepening really exist? I'm not sure. <laughs> and you're just going to blend those two colors together and building the crease with going back and forth with the two colors. <laughs> With a crisp brush, you're going to now add depth with a dark brown in that ending corner and here I'm using Lethal from Urban Decay. Then with a even tinier crisp brush, you want to add the shade Beaten, which is a cranberry shade. Now is my favorite step, grab an angled brush and your favorite concealer and start doing the cut crease. Now you want to take a flat brush and a gold shimmery eyeshadow. Here I'm using Gold Digger by Makeup Geek and I'm just going to pat that on half of your lid. Going back to your crease brush and the shade beaten, you're going to blend those colors with the Gold Digger. Now you want to take your favorite black eyeliner. <clears throat> By the way, this isn't my favorite black eyeliner at all. But I just have that, so yeah, I keep going. And yeah, do your wing liner. Now go on with your favorite mascara. This one is my favorite one. <laughs> And, and yeah, just go with two coats, or three coats, or whatever you want. And yeah, you can also add eyelashes if you want, but yeah, I didn't have some, so... Now I'm just grabbing a random contour palette from Nocibe and starting to contour my face. And now using the shade Diva from MAC, I'm just going to apply lipstick. And we're done! Now 
So this is the final look. I hope you enjoyed the video and that you'll try to recreate this makeup. If you do so, tell me in the comment section down there. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed. And yeah, see you next Sunday. Bye!